Louisiana is at risk of losing all of its swamp land. Wait, a Louisiana with no swamps? Is that even possible? It is. And we need to take new and innovative approaches if we want to save them in time. No one is sure how much swamp forest originally covered the state, but we do know that vigorous logging throughout the 19th and 20th centuries devastated our swamp land. Our best estimates suggest that by the late 1920s, after logging in the area had peaked, 98% of our forested swamps had been clear-cut. 1.6 million acres of swamp land, an area larger than Grand Canyon National Park, was decimated. Today we are continuing to lose what little swamp forest we still have left. That's alarming because swamps do a great job at slowing and absorbing storm surge, and without them our communities face increased risk during hurricane season. Traditionally, combating swamp loss relies on countless volunteers trudging through the swamp, planting one cypress sapling at a time, an important but time-consuming effort. If we want to save these critical swamp forests, we need to restore faster. Well, recently, Lake Pontchartrain Basin Foundation experimented with a new approach to swamp restoration. This plane is scattering seeds that we hope will turn this degraded swamp back into the lush forest it once was. Aerial seeding is a technique commonly used in agriculture. Crop seed is spread across the field by plane or helicopter. If this experiment is successful, the seeds scattered by this plane will grow into towering swamp trees like bald cypress and water tupelo. 